Our next speaker is School Board President T.R. Kanan. When I first started preparing for this speech, I was looking for some inspiration. So I reflected on my high school days and my own graduation. But I could not recall who spoke or what was said that day. The reason for that was simple. My school did not have a graduation ceremony. We also did not have any clubs, sports teams, a marching band, or many of the things we were able to offer you at Pensbury. But one thing we did have was a mandatory period that was actually called socially useful productive work. Yeah. So in that period, all the high school kids participated in activities that were of benefit to the society. So my theme today is threefold. Being thankful for what you have, showing gratitude, and being of service to others. Your class, you guys, did not need a mandatory period to demonstrate service to others. You did it on your own. Here are just a few examples. The Air Force JROTC held a 12-hour walk-run event to raise money for a soldier's hand, an organization that makes care packages to give to service members. A total of 35 students participated, 1,600 laps were completed, and they easily exceeded the goal of $1,000. The UNICEF club collected 1,635 pounds, which equates to 150 bags of clothes, to raise funds and help children. This spring, the Hold On You Matter Walkathon raised $1,100 to help with suicide prevention and awareness. <laughs> Pensbury Student Council sponsored a dodgeball tournament to raise money specifically for the victims of the California wildfires. The total raised was $3,000. Finally, the Minithon raised more than $65,000 to fight pediatric cancer. <laughs> These are just some of the ways, many ways, your class has given back to the community. So good job. Now let's talk about being thankful and showing gratitude. I was reading something the other day which said, I don't know if you know this, but the first 1,000 days of a child's life are the most critical for them. Do you know why? It's because the brain of the child is developing the most during those 1,000 days. And the quality of life the child has during those days sets the foundation for everything that follows. So let me ask you a question. Who influenced the first 1,000 days of your life and set the foundation for you? Your family. The same people who also decided to send you to Pensbury and are proudly watching your latest accomplishment today from the sides. So let's appreciate them. So finally, today is a unique day. It, it feels like the end of something, but it's actually the beginning. That's why we call this ceremony your commencement. You will now commence with the rest of your life and move beyond the walls of Pensbury High School. As you continue your journey, remember to be thankful, to be of service to others, and show gratitude. Best wishes and thank you.